My name is Wendy Welch and I would like to introduce you to my upcoming course called Paint Like an Artist. In this class, each week we're going to look at the work of a contemporary artist and talk about the different things that inspire the artists and also their processes and techniques and do in-class projects related to the artists as well as a homework assignment that is developed from the in-class projects. The first week we'll be looking at Hervin Anderson and you can see in this work which is called his barber shop series he's abstracted the shapes in the background so the painting becomes both representational and abstract so in this project we might take a photograph from your own living space and talk about how you might abstract it into geometric shapes the next week we'll be looking at Peter Doig. And one of the characteristics of Peter Doig's paintings are that he often has this screen of texture in front of the work. You can see little speckles, sometimes it appears to be snow. And so we'll talk about making a painting that is perhaps made of two sections like this one and also to create these sense of layers or screens in a work. The next artist is Cicely Brown, who started off as a figurative artist, and that's her work is really inspired by painting figures, but what her work really is about is the brush strokes. We'll make a painting that's really focused not on um, solid forms, but letting the brush strokes really create a sense of movement and play. The next artist, Rene Van Helm, in this series, Rene would take uh, images from interior decorating magazines and make collages out of them, and then the paintings would be based on those collages. And then we have Terry Winters, who he's really known for his drawings and prints as much as his painting. So for this week, we would really talk about the different ways to create drawings and he uses something, an idea about knot theory where you make these kind of nets or scribbles as a beginning source for the painting and then you develop it into a painting and we'll do some of those exercises in class. And then we have Mama Anderson, a Swedish painter and one of the things that she's known for is this really interesting combination of painting indoor and outdoor at the same time. And some of you might know that this is something Matisse did a lot where he would paint the interior and then paint the outside of the window. So that will be the focus of that week. So that gives you a general overview of what we're gonna do. And if you would like to register, you can register online at vancouverislandschoolart.com. Hope to see you there.